Hey guys, welcome to my tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to export down and back up all your Instagram photos using a nice simple service called Instaport. Basically what Instaport is, is basically a simple way to export or back up all your Instagram photos by downloading it all into a one zip file. Uh, from there you can actually export it and upload it to Google Plus, Facebook, or any kind of photo application that you want. So let's just jump right into it. Uh, what you want to do first is go to a website called instaport.me. The link will be down, down below in the description, so just click that. Um, from here, you'll have two steps. The first step is signing with Instagram. I'm going to do that here. It'll ask you to sign in. All right, you've done that, so it just brings you right here. So then the next step is to choose your export service. There will be two options there, but only one will be available to you, which is to download that zip file. The Facebook, Flickr, and RSS feed option is not available yet. It is coming soon, but depending on when you view this video, it may be out, maybe not. I don't know. So, in my case, I'm just going to click the download zip file, and you also have advanced options available to you. So, in, these, in the advanced options tab, you'll see the include all my photos, the last photos I took between the last couple photos I uploaded, uh, and all the photos I took between this date and this date. Uh, any photos I liked and any photos that have a certain hashtag that you specify in there so Within here. I'm just going to click the last two photos. I took and I'm gonna Click new export you may have a different option uh, depending on when you uh, did this so I'm just gonna click new export So then this this process can take anywhere from a minute to five minutes to ten minutes depending how many photos you're gonna be exporting so in my case, mine will probably be between like a minute and two. So I'm going to get right back with you guys once this is done. All right, so once the export is complete, it'll give you a link to download your photos. So just click that link and the download will begin. So from here, you can actually just extract it. I'm going to extract to my desktop and I'll show you it actually worked. So once the extract is done, you'll have your photos there. Picture of my cat. And also a picture of the circle pit slash mosh pit up on the lawn at Warped Tour 2012. So that's about it for this tutorial, guys. Thanks for watching. Please comment and subscribe. Hope you enjoyed. Hope this helped. If you have any questions, any kind of like concerns or whatever you want to call it, uh, PM me on YouTube. Hit me up on Twitter or just you know throw it up in the comment section i don't know so yeah my twitter is also down down below into the description i almost said downstairs oh well um so yeah i'll talk to you guys later peace <laughs>